Hello, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Have you ever felt such a strong connection to a particular piece of music that you wanted to get the lyrics tattooed on you or just scream them off a rooftop and share the song with everybody? Well, today we're going to be creating a physical way for you to express your love for any kind of song which is not a tattoo, so it's not that permanent. But yeah, today we're going to try and make some Spotify code earrings. Let's just get into it. So here's what you'll need for this project. Some shrinky dink paper, a pair of scissors, a hole punch, a sharpie or any other permanent marker, some white acrylic paint and a paintbrush, some jewelry pliers, some earring hooks and jump rings, and finally, you'll also need a printer. So to get started, just go into Spotify, choose your song and screenshot the Spotify code. Then go ahead and put that into a Word document, size it up so it's a little bit bigger. I'll put the measurements of my code on the screen. Be sure to mirror your code, then print two of them out. You already know what that means. Time to get this baby out of the closet. So now you can go ahead and trace this onto your shrinky dink plastic. It's smart to weigh the paper down with something heavy like your phone so it doesn't move while tracing. You don't need to include the logo for the code to work, but don't forget to leave a little bit of room at the top for the hole to be punched. As you can see they turn out really small so be careful when writing. Now you can go ahead and cut them out, then punch a hole at the top. Don't forget that the hole will shrink too. Now it's time for them to go into the oven. And now we wait. However, keep a close eye on your shrinky dinks because you have to be on the lookout for when they shrink, curl up and flatten again. So there's a matte and a shiny side. I'm now gonna put three layers of acrylic white paint on the matte side to make the code more easy to read. Now we can go ahead and assemble our earrings. Anyway, so that was it for this quick little video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all those things because it would really help me out on my YouTube journey. I upload new videos every Wednesday and lately in quarantine, I've been uploading a lot more. Anyways, I'll just see you in the next video. Bye.